presented by Figer Law. Team lead in home runs with 18. That's right behind him. They bat three and four. And then batting seventh, former Tiger Willie Wentz. Good numbers in his career against Minnesota. The lowest ER behind you. Work ahead so you can get. But Solano sends one deep off the right center field wall. Second base, he's got starters early. Jorge Polanco fouls the first pitch back. It's Owen. Missed that barrel. Polanco missed everything. Meaning Carpenter in the outfield. Fearling and McKinstry on the left side. Maton and Torkelson on the right side with Rob. In there for strike two. And Wentz is ahead. And a base hit into the corner. Second double of the inning for Minnesota. And they've the season. On the backhand, Veerling can't come up with it, and Kepler's have to make those type of plays. Quickly ahead of Ryan Jeffers. That's Which is it sail out of here. First, his ninth homer of the year. To go to that cutter, and this one just wins. And for Minnesota, that home run power pulls for it. There's out number two. Yeah, they like him in the Twin Cities, don't they? They do, and they have. Although today he's playing third base for the Twins. Inside, and he draws a walk. Away. Fifth hit of the Twins. Now nine hitter, Michael A. Taylor. Badu is under it. He's got it, and the inning is... Leads things off. And he looks at strike one. About doing it. The middle, but Correa is there on the backhand. Strong arms. It's elite when you talk about a guy pitching in the big leagues able to get that type of chase. But it. They'll throw him out at first, and there are two away. Luplo, Taylor, and Kepler in the outfield. Willie Castro and Donovan Solano at the corners. Playing up. Castro on the backhand. Can't make the Torkelson. Chops the first pitch foul. Torkelson strikes out. And Lopez. Donovan Solano, the leadoff man who doubled. On the first pitch he saw to right center field. Back in this ball game. I know. Polanco, who went struck out first time up. Starts him off with a cutter in for a strike. Huge for the Twins. Solano goes corner to corner. He's in. Carlos Correa had an RBI double in the first. On the warning track. At the wall, and it's gone. Has given up a three-run homer in the first, and that just fastball team to keep that hot streak. Rogers catches up to it to retire. Kept faces Ryan Jeffers, who took him deep for a three-run blast in the first. Going back, he's got room. Two away. Is under it. He's got it, and the inning is over or do more because it's them but you do have to enter into the fact that you're facing what has been the first the black guys doing the job not and that'll drop into center field for the second hit of the night for Detroit batting in the sixth spot and looks at one low and away well ball to third could be two farmers turn is in time when you're up here at a different stress level isn't it? Uh, it really is and, and especially for a guy like Zach McKinstry who's been Run for Farmer from his second base position. He gives way to Kepler right now. <laughs> two six packs or just two? <laughs> Willie Castro leads things off in the third. And as a 25 year old, you have to figure out. Execution, you have to at some point put the excuses behind you and you have to get the job done. For giving chase. That'll bounce. That's a ground rule double. Oh. Maton will get the out at. Swung on and missed. That's the changeup from Went. To retire him for the first time tonight. Gord for Polanco. Up and in, 1 0. Badu is there, and the inning is over.
Minnesota scores. Single from Veerling in the first and a soft serve from Carpenter in the second. Mm -hmm. A one hopper off the glove of Correa and Maton's aboard. Rogers way out in front. 0 and 1. Chip, I'll tell you what, big time pop. Switch hitter. Akil Badu grounded to short his first time off and fouls it back. Strikes out Badu for his fourth strikeout of the night. The chopper to the right side, Kyle Farmer on the charge, and the Tigers. Faces Carlos Correa, Max Kepler. Bat. Carpenter coming hard. An infield single for two. There's Badu. Two up. I've hit I've heard hitters talk about back spinning the base, but he isn't taught as much these days. Carpenter chasing in right field and makes the running grab. Outfielder and vice versa. Yeah, that's who he is, man. I mean, he, he just, he, he's all about. It's tough sledding against Pablo Lopez, one away. Torkelson was a strikeout victim in the first. Experience, you watch this guy. Not Torkelson's out. He's quickly ahead of Carpenter, 0-2. They finally retire Carpenter. That every home game they have. Yeah, and you've been a big part of it. It's pretty special. Even when you throw them a good pitch, they can still find a way to get the barrel to it. <laughs> yeah, and well, that's, that's exactly what getting Polanco back in his lineup is. Well, it, ex it extends your lineup. You know, and, and thought we were on Nat Geo for a moment. We've <laughs> <laughs> been traveling a lot, Chef. Those hotel. <laughs> yeah, I agree. I was just watching the ball around the strike zone. Again, you talk about. I couldn't agree more. Before you came up here, I told Chef, just watching Pablo knowing him. Think about Jamie Moyer to you, man. You just feel like you were always waiting too long to get it. America Park, Tigers in an 8 0 hole. Minnesota scored four in the first, three in the second, one in the pitch. Cabrera strikes out. If you're a fan of the game, how people go about their business. His tempo, his. You think? 100%. Right. Left that one up, though. This year in American League. He's Not to mention, did you see that two seam action there? And eliminate one of the two. That move to second, perhaps third. Players on the field. Luplo calls for it. And that's the second. It's been pretty impressive from Jay. Drive to center. Taylor is there, and the Tigers strand Michael A. Taylor to start. And then it'll be Donovan Solano and Jorge Polanco. He really Veerling on a two hop. One away. A high strike, 0 and 1. Easy out, number two. Be simple. What's your best stuff? Throw it. <laughs> Throw your best pitches. Get out. That's a 1 2 3 inning. Statues are in left center field here at Comerica Park. Simple. Up the middle for Correa. Making those plays behind him. Well, this guy, he keeps you on your toes at all times. And you love playing behind a guy self. One up. On track. As you said. Veerling strikes out for the second time tonight. Two. Man aboard and two away. Strike three called, and the Tigers are out in the sixth. And I looked at him. I recognized him right away. I said, I think I remember that pitch. He said, you're not going to throw him that. Curly being extremely careful. Think about that. 121 strikeout. He went. Over the heart of the dish. Jeffers looks at strike one. Plenty of room for Riley Green for as well. What a, what a talent. I think he was going was he going to Miami? He's not running an option. 
he's, he's a drop back. Well, this is an interesting nugget. Had he gone to Florida? 48 with 69 homers with okay. the St. Catherine Blue Jays. I'm trying to figure out how he never was named MVP. 338 career. You're right, Shep, but not having MVP. Taylor got a good jump. It's time up. First. That's one. Right. Cam, the hard thing about that is you make an impression, a positive impression. Pressure starts to mount. It goes and it is caught at the wall by Max. But I think because it's so elite, he's lost the feel for the fastball of late. So when I can get a swing and miss. How about that? Right on cue, buddy. Great call. One out. And they will clash here with one out in the eighth. At 95, he misses outside. A walk to Taylor. Let the chips fall where they may. Goes back to that breaking ball. Just missed. Gallo walks for the second time tonight. And the low and inside, 1-0. Oh. It's borderline uncomfortable, isn't it? It really is. Painted, and he got him. He went with a four-seamer. That gets the nine one-and-two hitters in the Tigers' order. Jake Rogers, Akil Badu. Oh, and a quick out. Akil Badu looks at one low, and it's on the corner to ring him up. Back-to-back -back strike. On an 0-2 pitch, and he will get there. Throwing a great job of hustling the second base for Riley Green. Still playing the game hard. That's Hangs in there, singles his third time up, and then doubles here in the eighth. Now moves to... Sticks with the fastball right there. Oh, you're going to hit your way on. Finally, Hedrick wins the battle. Veerling goes down.